While eyes might be drawn to the skies during the total solar eclipse, law enforcement is warning drivers to keep that same focus on the roads after totality. Every trooper is going to be out there working. Sergeant Carrie Holes with the Indiana State Police says nearly 4 million Hoosiers live within the path of totality. And on April 8th, they're expecting more than half a million visitors to come to Indiana. In response, there will be additional troopers spread throughout state highways and interstates to ensure drivers stay safe. When the eclipse is over, all those people are going to want to leave relatively at the same amount of time. So they have to be prepared for long lines, a lot of traffic on the road. And officials say before you get behind the wheel, be sure you have water, snacks, phone charger and solar eclipse glasses packed. And be sure your tank is filled with gas because you may be sitting in traffic for a while. Don't pull to the side of the interstate. Don't pull to the side of the state highway to, to view the event. Find a location to get to so that we can keep those roads open. And with roughly 100,000 visitors expected in Jackson County alone, their emergency management and Homeland Security Director Dwayne Davis says it's crucial. Those roadways aren't blocked so first responders can get around. Maybe it'll be a longer route to get there, but it may be quicker because we can monitor where the heavy traffic flow is and try to divert them around. And Davis says they're taking an all hands on deck approach, including having their volunteer fire departments manned that day. And if one fire department goes out on something, another one can come in and support that area. And as officials work together to keep the roadway safe, they're reminding families to be cautious and remain patient. Jamie Mays, WLKY News.